guys, you know what time it is. Time for the February 2020 Keto Crate unboxing. Like, it's already February, the year's over. I know I say that every month, but like, come on you guys, February already? <sighs> but you know what that means? Most snacks. Let's go ahead and jump into it and see what we have here. Oh my goodness. Oh, look, they're little Valentines. Oh my goodness. I know who I am giving these to, uh, my honey bunny Richard. If you don't know about him, you can watch that video all about it right there. Oh my gosh, but look at all these cute little Valentines. I am obsessed. And once again, guys, can we just talk about the quality of the pamphlets? Like, there's recipes, there are activities. I mean, I am obsessed with this copy. Now we get to dig in. First, okay, we have Ultima Replenisher. This is electrolyte water. You guys, you already know how I feel about electrolyte drinks. If I'm drinking me some electrolyte drink, it's gonna be a zip fizz. But I will say I really do like these Go Ultimas because they don't have any of the icky sweeteners that Zip Fizz has in it, but like, I don't care. In here we have, it looks like a lemon, raspberry, and grape. I had this at KetoCon last year. I mean, it's good, but like Zip Fizz is my number one. But if you're looking for clean ingredients, this is the clear winner. I know that. Oh my gosh, Smart Cakes? I haven't seen these guys in ages. These are, oh, vanilla latte smart cakes. Oh, look at that. I used to love smart cakes back in the day. I just have not had them in a long time. Serving size is one cake. Now, the thing I remember about these things, first of all, is they squish in your ear. Like, if you squeeze a smart cake, I mean, yeah, you can hear it squish. Secondly, though, that they have, like, basically no calories or no anything. Okay, so there are two smart cakes in here, and for one smart cake, there are 38 calories, two and a half grams of fat, there's nine total carbs, five of fiber, and four of erythritol, so that's like zero net carbs, what? And four grams of protein. I mean, yeah, that's also what I remember, zero net carbs. I don't know how they accomplished it, but then again, I'm not asking any questions. Oh, but vanilla latte is gonna be very interesting, so I am excited to give those a try. Uh-oh, we have Monk Pack. That's a weird name. <laughs> it's a keto granola bar. I'm trying to feel the texture. I do feel some texture here. It says one gram of sugar, two net carbs. It's the peanut butter flavor. Now this could be exciting. For one bar, it's 140 calories, 12 grams of fat, 13 total carbs, four grams of dietary fiber, and I'm guessing the rest is allulose. Yeah, okay, that's where it is. Uh, and then five grams of protein. I am excited about this. Oh my God, I'm also excited about a Kiss My Keto uh, chocolate cookie dough bar. You guys, these are my favorite. I had these for the first time in a keto crate a long time ago, and then I met these people at KetoCon, and I basically just kept walking by their booth like, oh, sample, oh, I'll have another one. Like, you know, I would like put a mustache on <laughs> just so I could get more of these samples. Oh, and this is my favorite flavor. I know I'm gonna love this. I'm so excited. Oh, I guess I'll talk about it a little bit. One bar is 230 calories, 19 grams of fat, 17 total carbs, 12 fiber, two sugar alcohol. So what is that? Three net carbs? Mm, I'm here for this all day. Uh, and nine grams of protein. Even though, don't get me wrong, the very first ingredient is chicory root fiber. I mean, like, this stuff right here, this is definitely like an occasional treat. I wouldn't have this as part of my everyday diet, but I do love this stuff. Oh my God, a keto bar chocolate covered strawberry. I haven't ordered the keto bars on the website. So I'm so glad that they're included in the keto crate supporting my BFFs, uh, Keto Connect right there. You guys, I love keto bars. They're probably my favorite clean keto snack. I mean, these are just such high quality ingredients and it tastes good. Scratch that, and it tastes great. Okay, for this bar, there are 160 calories, 18 grams of fat, 17 total carbs. Oh, that's a lot higher than their normal ones. Seven fiber and five erythritol, so that's five grams of net carbs. I mean, you're gonna you're gonna get that with fruit, uh, and then five grams of protein. All right, yeah, let's let's look at the ingredients here: chocolate, almonds, coconut, strawberry, erythritol, cocoa, water, coconut oil, salt, stevia, and natural flavors. I mean, to me, this is a winner. What is not a winner is this meat stick. 
Um, but it is a Tomer Kosher original beef stick. I'm just, I'm not gonna like it. I know I'm not. I may or may not try this on my Smash the Crate series with my mom. Like, I just know we're not gonna like it. So maybe I'll just give it to her. Maybe I'll just keep it and start a stockpile for the Great Meat Stick Away version two. I don't know, but like, you guys, it's a meat stick. I'm not gonna talk about it. Ooh, what, ooh, what is this soft cookie here? We have soft batch cookie from Explo oh, Explorado Market. I think these people were also at KetoCon last year. Oh, they were so good. Ooh, cinnamon roll, soft batch cookie. I am not mad, it is soft. Like, oh my goodness. Okay, this nutrition label was printed on, on somebody's home printer, but that's totally fine. Um, for this cookie, there are 180 calories, 15 grams of fat, five proteins, 16 total carbs, three fiber, one sugar alcohol, 10 allulose, so it says two net carbs here. I mean, this just feels amazing. I'm really excited to try this. Oh, and we got some um, better than good snacks. Veggie protein puffs with ranch. I'm not mad at that. I'm imagining these are similar to a shrewd food. I don't know. One packet, which I love that they call this a packet. <laughs> One packet is 110 calories, three and a half grams of fat, three total carbs, and there's no fiber or sugar alcohol, so I mean, this is just three net carbs for the package, uh, and then 16 grams of protein. Yeah, it's just definitely a high protein snack here. Once we get to the bottom, there are some questionable oils and like fruits and vegetables, like apple, cranberry, carrot, beet, you know, like things we wouldn't normally eat, but I bet it's in such small quantity here that it doesn't really matter. You guys, so we not only have a beef stick, we have a beef hunk. This is DNX grass-fed beef, uncured bacon, sea salt, and cracked pepper bar. Uh-oh, she might have to try this one. Does this say uncured bacon? Absolutely. I will open this one up. Like, I tend to like meat patties better than the meat sticks, so I know I'm going to at least try this one, and I hope I like it. Okay, oh my gosh, I already see what's at the bottom. I'm sorry, you guys, spoiler alert. Oh my gosh, but we have some intact snacks, some crunchy cheese. You guys, this is just like moon cheese, like a puffed cheese snack. This is spicy, and you guys know I love spicy things, so hopefully I'm gonna love this. I have become obsessed with these puffed cheese snacks. I also found myself walking past those booths at KetoCon a lot. Okay, there are two servings in this container, and each serving is 80 calories, six grams of fat, less than one total carb, that's good, and five grams of protein. Like, oh my gosh, I really hope I love these. I hope I love these. And then we have some, oh my gosh, some rosschocolates.ca. Okay, these are dark chocolate thins with hazelnut. Oh, is this kind of like a bark or something like that? I don't know, I'm gonna try it. I do like that it gives you a per serving and per container listing on the nutritional info because once I open this, it ain't getting closed again. Total fat per serving, which is five pieces, which once I open it, I'll be excited to see exactly what a piece is. Five pieces is 12 grams of fat, 14 total carbs, seven fiber, and five sugar alcohol. So that's two net carbs per five pieces uh, and then one gram of protein. The ingredients are cocoa mass, inulin, erythritol, cocoa butter, hazelnut, natural vanilla extract, stevia, glycoside, and milk. When I was in Paris, I rediscovered my love for hazelnut. Like, they put hazelnuts on everything over there, and it's mostly chocolate and hazelnut together. It's just like your Nutella dream, and I fell in love with it. Like, they're called noisettes <laughs> in French. <laughs> I am particularly excited to try this candy. All right, and then finally, taking up the bottom of the box. Oh, how am I gonna get this out of here? Okay, oh, it's coming, ah, that's it. Bam! Oh my gosh, Magic Spoon cereal. I'm so excited to try it. I'm so excited to try it. I've just heard nothing but great things about this, and of course, we all know about the lovely print that they have here. Like, ah, oh, this is the fruity kind. I'm expecting a Fruit Loop, a Trix, a Fruity Pebble, if you will. Like, I'm expecting to love these, and I hope I am not disappointed. I will definitely be disappointed by the serving size, which is three-fourths cup. That's actually not too bad. Um, 110 calories. We have six grams of fat, eight total carbs, two fiber, so that is six net carbs, and 12 grams of protein. So yeah, this is just gonna be like a, a sweet protein bit 
but I am here for it. Okay guys, overall, this is genuinely the most excited I've been about a keto crate in like four months. There are so many things in here that A, I've never tried, or B, know that I love, or C, I'm just genuinely interested in. Like, I am so excited. I cannot wait to smash this crate with my mama in the next video, okay? So stay tuned for that. Okay, so based on everything that I've just unboxed here, Comment down below, what would you be most excited to try? What have you already tried? Have you tried this? Have you tried these chocolates? Let me know in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, watch Autumn Keto. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> I'm gonna get back in the routine of making weekly videos here and there, but just know that you can always catch the monthly Keto Crate unboxing and the monthly Smash the Crate with my mother. Okay guys, see you next time. Bye.